Hello friends and welcome back to Cub Camp TV as we jump into this another episode of Drill Around the World. I've been looking forward to doing this one for a while. Um, this is a track that got sent over to me quite recently um, by my dude Pedrin and uh, yeah after he's seen that we were doing this sort of uh, looking at drill in different countries and how drill music is influencing different cultures around the world and how different musical themes are becoming part of it in different places around the world he sent over a link to me and was like dude you've got to react to this so um, yeah here we are we're reacting to it. Um, first of all before we get into it however um i hope you like the new intro to um drill around the world um as i said um as i've said before radio is very much my main bag at the moment but i am trying to keep a hand in with the production side of things um so yeah all produced by myself so um if you enjoy the tune maybe i'll put the tune out for full um one day if this series really really pops off but we'll see about that um but yeah we're going to jump into this one next um i'm looking forward to doing this one as per if you are liking the video please do hit like on it as we go leave a comment let me know how you're feeling and uh yeah i'm looking forward to this one um let's get into it shall we yeah Cinematic. Ooh. I already like this one. I've got to say, I already like the fact it's very kind of wavy from the off. I like the video as well. I like this sort of um, like ripped paper thing they're doing. I don't know if it was just me that heard that because I'm vibing to this, but there's a bit around here where it almost sounds like whale song in the background. <laughs> it's cool though. I've got to say the Spanish accent sounds very cool over um over the sort of trappy rolling drill sound. It it fits really really nicely. What I really like about this more than anything else, actually, straight from the off, I know I'm pausing a lot on this one, but what I really, really like about this one straight out the gate is the fact that um, he's got a very unique flow. It's very much on beat, but he's also very smooth with it. There's a lot of kind of different pockets he's finding. Um, and as a vocalist, that's something that isn't actually that easy to do, um, especially over the sort of um, the sort of strictness of drill beats. And he's doing, I think he's doing a really good, really good job of it, to be honest with you. I really, the video looks cool as well. It's kind of, it does kind of look like, I won't lie, this shot here, it looks like they've just gone, oh, we'll film a shot, people just do what you like. Um, so it's a little bit uncoordinated. That's the first thing I've, I've disliked about this tune. The video just seems a little bit, the video as it's progressed, it seems to have got like less impactful. It looked good at the start and it's just sort of descended a little bit, which is a, which is a shame because I, I was really, really enjoying the video. <laughs> I do like the luminous um face mask going on up here. <laughs> luminous <laughs> luminous orange face mask. If you if you want to remain concealed, luminous orange face mask. It won't give you away. <laughs> It's a big hat. Got the flipping Batmobile. But in red. Actually looks a bit like the Spider-Man logo, doesn't it, really? Oh, 
that's good. That's nice. Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I like the tune. Um, I, I, I've got to say, I prefer the tune to the video on this one. The, the, the tune's very kind of well put together. Again, it's only a two-minute tune, so there's only so much we can talk about it. Um, but in general, the main vocalist, um, Cuban Zantana, um, he's got quite a nice grasp of um, sort of flows and movements, and his general kind of direction with things works really, really nicely. Again, a good use of auto-tune. I know I said it sounded a little bit like Whale Song or whatever in the middle, but it's, it's cool. It's a cool addition, and it's definitely something that's very unique um, to this tune like we hear it a little bit in the sort of stuff that future does um over over in america obviously but i feel this is the first time i've heard it outside of america over drill rather than um rather than a more sort of trap sort of atl sort of sound so it sounds it sounds quite cool again the video i'm not too sure about um i think the video on this one it's a little bit uh i don't know it just seems a bit thrown together it starts out really cool and then it just almost seems like a lot of the shots are just kind of like almost like backup footage um to an extent and i don't know if that's done intentionally um it might be a creative thing that i'm just not that that up on or whatever but yeah for me for me the video kind of lets the tune down a little bit but overall uh good and it's interesting as well so there we go we've now done three countries in our journey around the world three countries there we are my, my, my camera's up there not over there um but yeah that was my uh, reaction video to cuban zantana with loca i think this one came out about three weeks ago so yeah we're trying to stay up to date with these reaction videos rather than digging up stuff from the past i want to make sure we're as up to date as possible as uh, as the globe keeps turning so yeah there we go out to everyone who is supporting in these videos as well i do hope you enjoyed this one and as i've said before if there's any uh if you've got any contrasting opinions or anything you wanted to say about the um the tune itself any information i may have missed please do leave it in the comment section below i do read all the comments um uh, where i can i should i try to keep up to date with all of them at the moment obviously the channel's growing so it's still uh still very much manageable at the moment but yeah if you are liking the kind of content we're putting out there please do hit subscribe um and like the videos and leave comments and all that good stuff um the growth means a lot and uh, obviously the channel is growing quite quickly for a uh for a new channel so um yeah i do appreciate all the support as i said before um i think this one's likely to be coming out uh in the middle of the week or so so um make sure you lock in monday to friday 10 to 11 30 brecky in the cave live in this room interviewing a ton of different guests um and yeah keeping it fresh and funky in the morning so there we go out to everyone who's been watching this one and we will see you next time peace